Hey, good morning, everybody. In a classroom at the Camp Casey Community Activity Center, Area 1 officers and warrant officers stand up to ask questions about the revised officer evaluation report, which is undergoing major changes for the first time in 15 years. On this new OER, how will the branch managers see that? How will they data mine it? At the end of a question stands a subject matter expert who was identified by the Human Resources Command at Fort Knox, Kentucky to be part of a mobile training team to come to Korea and brief the Army's newly revised officer evaluation report. My question back to the system is, the most rewarding part of the brief to me is all the questions that are asked. This new evaluation is a brand new thing. The last time a new evaluation was rolled out in the Army was back in either 1997 or 1998. I was a second lieutenant. So they know the importance of this. Everybody's taking it very seriously, and many, many, many officers have good questions that they ask. Are they separate? Yes, they're separate. They are separate. They Some of the common exactly questions yes. are centered around the, the management of the profile on the Raider. Managing a profile can be somewhat complicated for many officers um, that have never done that before. Being able to answer all the questions is still not easy to Major Trotter, even though managing evaluations has been part of his job since he first switched from enlisted to officer. I've had the benefit of being able to have that knowledge built into me along the way. By all means, I'm a, I'm a field grade major now. I, I still don't have all the answers. I see it as a great move, and I see it as a great transition for the Army, um, continually improving. Do that same type of thing. Specialist Pedro Amador, Camp Casey, Korea. We've all checked it at least once.